Good morning. My name is Wendy Literal, and I am a web and graphic designer in uh, just outside the DC area. And I am trying to update my Dropbox. My Dropbox holds my whole life. <laughs> so I just wanted to give an update about how to delete a file um, if it says that you don't have the permissions to do it. Now, just a little bit of back history. I had gone through, um, I updated from like an education version to like a, a regular Windows version. And from that I went to, I've, I landed on Windows Home. <laughs> so that's all you need to know. But I've got um, a couple iterations of Dropbox that kind of got dragged and then put into another one. And then they got nested into another one that I had multiples of files. Like I'm in here trying to clean this up. and. One of the things I ran into was, and I'll even show you, if I try to delete this file, it's going to tell me, oh, well, you're not, you need administrative privileges to do this. And then I click OK. And then it's going to tell me, hey, you don't have the privileges for it. But I would already gone in here and set myself as the owner of these things because, you know, just a quick Google search will tell you to set yourself as the owner so that you can delete it. But it still doesn't work. So I wanted to do a quick video because typically when things drive me nuts they're driving other people nuts so basically this isn't gonna work so what just so that I can kinda catch you up on what the issue was if I went in here this is what the stuff I read online tells me to do it says to go in here go to security then go to advanced and then go in here and up here change yourself to the owner right and which obviously I did this is me this is my Windows login this should work it doesn't work so what I found that I should do, because I'm like, there's some other setting that's got to be wrong here. Um, and I did it on an interior file first, just so that I could kind of tell where my problem was. Like, I can't delete any of these. I'll get the same problem, right? So this is what you're going to do, right? You're going to go to click on your file. I mean, really, you go to your, your highest folder that you're going to delete, but just so that I can show you multiple times. <laughs> click on right click, go to properties, go up to security. And then you're going to go down to here. Um, I'm sorry, you're going to click on advanced and then you're going to get this window. And again, this says my ownership. I'm the owner, so can't delete it. So what you want to go to do, and there's probably something else going on there, like maybe I'm not really the owner, but I'll figure that out another time. Um, see where it says deny everyone. I don't know how this got on there. It's I'm sure it had something to do with like dragging from one to another, like, you know, re-upping the computer after the hard drive crash. Like, I don't know. Like I had multiple things go wrong. My hard drive crashed. I had to up change my windows to windows home. Like I had to do a whole bunch of things. So it's here. It says deny. I'm highlighting it. I hit remove, hit okay, hit okay. It deletes. <laughs> so it's not going to let me delete all of them because I get a different window when I do this. And somebody that knows more than I do probably knows the workaround for this because if I go to advanced, it still doesn't help me. So I'm finding that I have to do it for each individual one that it doesn't actually affect it on the, um, like the folder level. So as soon as I finish doing this, it's going to fix it. But I feel like I should be able to do this to every single like, like in a mass collection. I mean, what if I had, there's like 10 here, but like, what if I had like 10,000 files, <laughs> you know, it's like, obviously this wouldn't work for that. So I wonder what it is that will let me do a mass edit of my, um, removing the extra users. So anyway, that's how you do it. That's a quick fix. Hopefully you don't have a million files. Um, if you, somebody does know the, the quicker way to do this, I am all ears because I'm sure this is not the last time I will run into it. And if you know, please put it in the comments because I do read my comments and I will be very much appreciative because <laughs> like I said, I'm still going through all my Dropbox. I'm still trying to like clean everything up because I've got gigs and gigs of useless repetitive stuff and I'm trying to just make it go away because it's eaten up all my hard drive space. So if anybody does know the answer to this, I will be very appreciative if you would put it in the comments because I don't have the right Google keywords to search for <laughs> because this took a lot to find this out and this was more trial and error. Once I got to kind of the right place, then I kind of fixed it. So I guess I'll cut the video off there. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I do appreciate it. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below and I'll talk to you later. Don't forget to like and subscribe because it does make the YouTube gods happy and it helps me grow my channel. All right. Thanks so much. Take care. Bye-bye.